one of the games that those people played is they were trying to call me a chameleon, but actually they were chameleon around me. And the proof of that is predated. <laughs> it's predated from the Midwest, okay? Um, when I was in the Midwest, I was running energy work channels and fitness channels. And um, everybody knows how strong my core is. You've commented on my six pack and stuff. It's actually been a topic since I was like 13 years old. <laughs> Go ask my martial arts class or my friends in high school. I've always had that core strength when I build it. It's something that people go, wow, you have like quite the abs on you. It doesn't take long for me to build up. And whenever I would do something, they would try to make it there. So I was running my fitness class and then they tried to make it like, we're fitness people. Obviously not. I don't see a six pack on that in, in that area except for mine. Okay, so let's start there. And then they tried to make it like their thing. When I had expressed an injury, which I've been talking about for years, ligaments of the neck, you already know, the T1, T2, one of those, I can't remember, both are off. So it says a chiropractor ages ago, is, I know it's a T2, I'm not sure if it's also the T1, I'd have to have that part double check. My right hip is slightly up, which is why I walk with a hitch in my step. step you've commented on that before. Um, my side has damage. It goes down my shoulder blades, my spine. And um, recently I've been trying to work out my hips because what ends up happening is it's a shooting pain, triple shooting pain, <laughs> through my legs, the inside, the outside, and another part kind of in between of my legs is shooting fucking pain. Okay, well, we've gone through this for years and then I'm on my class talking about, you know, my injury and what's her face tries to make it her own. But it's after the mm. fact that I've gone live on Vigo to do this. It's always after. That's the proof is I fucking did it first. And they try mm. to do this to be like, she's a chameleon. And they're asking me about my braiding skills and stuff. I don't even know what you guys are talking about. Mm. I just, uh, when things are really dusty or windy, I'll braid my hair so that there's no mm. dust in it. So that was more what was happening was I was just braiding my hair because it's so freaking dusty in those areas. Um, but, you know, and then that became a thing of, of what my braiding skills were. I don't even understand that one, but that obviously became a thing where they were being competitive or whatever. I'm, I, wow, dude, I'm like literally just putting my hair up so it's out of my face so I could do work. It's just Anything else? Oh, grasping at straws. Yeah, that's funny because um, that whole thing came from a known source and they had known it to be exactly what I said it was, uh, which is a, a tincture, a clarified THC, and they had known the makers of it personally and then claimed it to be something else. Yeah, you can go ask Ron. He's the one who gave it to me and it's just, it was just clarified THC. They knew that too. Grasping at straws, huh? So, okay. And on and on and on.